hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're a new subscriber thank you for subscribing make sure you like comment you know turn your post impressions so whenever i drop another video and if you are no subscriber thank you for taking me i love you guys you guys are the real mvp so today i'm going to be reviewing our skin doctor sunscreen yeah whitening sun protection and i think you need to know about this screen this sunscreen because i've been using it for a while and i'll tell you four reasons why you should get the sunscreen and if you didn't want to know that so make sure you stick to the end of this video Mwah. you guys five reasons why you need to buy the skin doctor sun whitening protection cream yes so first off i want to talk about it is that it is very affordable it is pocket friendly for the price and what it does number one it doesn't leave a white cast on your skin when you use it, it's non greasy. You know, there are some sunscreens that you use, especially when they are super duper affordable. Then, when you use them, everybody will not use the sunscreen. As why some people do not like to use sunscreen. And as a beginner, you need to know how to apply your sunscreen on your face. And you know what sunscreen is? I think I should just explain what sunscreen is before I go into the depth of this video. So, sunscreen is like a combination of ingredients together, like sun, you can call it sunblock too to prevent your face from sun damages sunburn especially when you're using a vitamin c serum or you're using any brightening serum moisturizing cream or lotion so sunscreen is something something is sunscreen actually is vital in our since uh, skincare routine you need to know how to apply it when to apply it why you need it first off you need it anytime you're going out just because of the rays and all of that the sun and just to not have these black eyes on that if you apply your sunscreen before going out you are good to go and you need to know the spf like spf the amount of spf in your sunscreen before you use it and you need to know the amount of spf in any sunscreen before you buy it like this one it has spf 60 and i think it is really really recommendable because if you are using the one that have spf 15 I will not advise you guys to use it so SPF 60 is very 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 good so the first thing I said before is it is super duper affordable it is pocket friendly you don't have to break the band to use it and it doesn't leave a white cast on your skin that's another reason why because any sunscreen that you can afford like you can afford maybe they're selling it for I got this for 27 yes and you can get it for 27 it should definitely leave a white cast on your skin. I don't know about others. Like gave ya, I gave ya some block. Uh, you guys should know it. I think I'll just drop it here. That one is super the power for the book. But I'm not using but I've seen a lot of you know a lot of reviews about it and I think it's super nice. This is the sunscreen I've been using and I really love it so much. So I'm trying to review it for you guys so you guys know what to get. And second thing I said it is non-greasy, it doesn't leave a white cast on your skin. When I apply it for you guys, I will try to explain what that means. And the other one it has spf 60 in it and that is a real real big deal for other creams and um sunscreen some you see spf 15 30 and all of that but this one to have 60 i think there's another that has 80 yes but i know about this one that has 60 and it is super duper nice for your skin to have like for your um, sunscreen to have spf 15 in it. yes so guys and another thing is that it helps let me read it for you guys so that you know you try to get what i'm saying it you know it protects the skin against uv and uvb radiation i think i've spoken about this before in my video and it moisturizes your skin too and the thing about this is if you really know how to apply this sunscreen here yeah, it's not going to leave a white cast on your skin that's if you know how to apply it and if you're a beginner that do not know apply especially beginners there are some people that have seen that always complain about sunscreen that when you apply it once you apply it rather if it is not expensive yeah if it's not expensive it tends to leave you know white cast on your skin and i will show you guys how to apply this and how i'm going to apply it for you guys to see that it doesn't leave any white cast on your skin it is really really nice to be honest i don't want to you know it's for all skin type and another thing i want to say is that if you have dry skin oily skin combination skin wrinkles anti-aging and all of that you can actually use this sunscreen it doesn't irritate your skin if you have sensitive skin there are some people that react to everything i think i'm i'm um I'm getting, you know, i react to most of these things and i have to read them read and read and study them that's why i even started the skincare vlog because i all tend to react to almost everything i use 
so i started reading everything about skincare so i know more about skincare and i felt like oh it would be nice to share with you guys so that you guys know what you are what you can react to if you have an oily skin what you can use and i think i spoke about oils like type of oils you can use and all of that i think i have a video of that so you can check that out too and i started researching on it so to know what to be able to use before i come and my vlog my youtube channel was not even for skincare so i was not a fan i just now apply cream on my face and that was all but when i started reading and deciding what not to use for my face and all of that i you know i decided to you know make this channel also about skincare that's not the main fact of the channel too they have beauty lifestyle and tips and all of that but back to what we're talking about so i'm going to be showing you guys how to apply it and the amount you need to apply for this skincare as you can see this is it and you need to dip it to absorb to your skin yeah i think i've not applied any skin here i just use my toner on my face that's after i finish cleansing i use my toner on my face and my vitamin c serum i'm using dr rachel vitamin c serum i think i've actually reviewed that too for you you can watch the video that i have and this is it so ow. so let's you know and if you notice yeah it's very easy me i do not have to know the fake and original let me talk about that to how to know i tend to buy my skincare products from the supermarket like blend calls most of these popular supermarkets because they tend to sell original they do not buy fake products i don't i will never go to there are some skincare shops that you see that they sell carol white all of that i'm not saying they do not have the originals but i will never go there to buy my skincare product because i do not trust anybody if you're a nigerian person you know you know about back I don't know, I don't know, but I tend to buy my skincare product from them, and this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see it here. This is what it looks like, super duper affordable. I think I will just, I got it from Blanco. I think two nine or two seven. I can't really remember, but I'm going to show you guys how to apply it and to not break it. So this is it. I the tube is actually kind of big compared to those expensive skincare that don't leave the white cast on your face. So you need to know how to apply this skincare if you want to use it. So I'm just going to put a little. I'm using my left hand. This is my left hand. So I'm going to put a little here. Can can you see how it's coming out? So this is what I'm going to be using, and I'm just going to put it in my hand. I think I'm applying foundation, you know, to my skin. Yeah. That's how it's going to be. Let's roll. If you know how to apply it well, guys, forget I need it to absorb for a while before it goes because you need to apply. I try to apply my name to like just like here, you know, because that part is part of your face and all of that somewhere that is very very visible so i'm going to leave this to absorb for a while i don't know if you guys can see it how it blends into my skin so i'm going to leave it to absorb for a while then let me work on this or oh, my side so i'm just going to apply it because i'm not really going out so i'm not applying much on my face i'm just going to apply it and try it with here This is what it will look like if you do not blend it well. So I'm just going to leave it to absorb the rub. I'm going to moisturize it into my face where you see what it's going to be looking out. Not like going to leave this white cast looking you know. You leave it for a while too. So guys, this is what it's going to look like. And if you leave it for a while, it will absorb into your skin if you leave it for like two to three minutes it will definitely absorb into your skin and there's not any you know white cast you apply before you leave your house and i think for it to leave this amount of white cast like not too much for that price you are good to go i advise you to get this sunscreen it's not like it was a sponsored page or anything you know? but i just a sponsored video i just want to talk about it it is really really nice and super duper affordable can you guys see how it has blend into my skin without even finishing the video yes that is like tips to block you from any skin barrier 
no matter the whitening product you are using i do not advise people to use whitening products if you are not fair do not bleach your skin do not damage your skin because your skin becomes so sensitive that even if you have a little injury it just escalate to something else so this is what you are going to have and um yeah and please make sure that anytime you're using any vitamin C serum, make sure you use your sunscreen. Sunscreen is a very, very vital, important essentiality in your skincare. So that's the end of our video today. I reviewed it, guys. So this one is not going to waste. I'm definitely going to pack it back. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. No, no, in my hand that's all so that's this is what my face looks like after i my sunscreen and voila you're good to go so so i've come to the end of today's video in case you have any question for me in case you want to know more about skincare in case you have just drop it and if you have want us to do any collaboration kindly you know message me on my instagram i love you guys so much make sure you like comment subscribe if you have found this video so educative and entertaining make sure you subscribe you know and share to your friends. I love you guys. See you in my next video. Mwah.